I said I'm ready. Brackus is like really freaking far away. I'm totally ready. He's. It says he's. <laughs> I'm um 200% poison. Even though he's like he looks like a human. He's yeah. They all are. I was yeah. just having a look when uh, in, in the break. Hello, everyone. By the way. Oh hi! Welcome back, everybody. Um. To Divinity the, Original Sin Two. Kraken Final slight, Maybe. The Kraken. Probably. The Kraken, Kraken is slightly uh, vulnerable to air. Oh good. For your supernovas and that. That's that's awesome. Um, actually. His Beal doesn't seem that bad. She's a geomancer. Weak to fire, yeah. so. Okay. So she's well, the weak link, obviously, but. Right. Or clearly Dallas is gonna go down first because she's actually next to us. Um I'm f I feel like maybe I should uh switch to my bow for this fight after we kill Dallas. Do you want, I mean, do you want to leave Dallas and see if she... I know she's red, but she might decide that these guys are worth killing and go on our side for a bit. Uh, okay. She might. She might, I guess. But she's quite... I mean, she's a long way away from you. Just try it. Just see what she does. Okay. Oh, I didn't reset my cooldowns. Dang it. No, we've gone straight in, haven't we? So, yeah. Bane's got no armor. Prince has got no yeah. armor. Lose's got no magic armor. Still got evading on, though. Alright, um. Well. I guess I'll just switch to my bow then. Because I can't do anything else. So is the Kraken weak to fire? Yeah, uh, just air. Just, just air. And okay. immune to poison. Otherwise, just various resistances. Okay. Water's not a good idea. All right. Well, I can only grab fire, so do that. Like eight eyes. I like how we've met this at the end. It was the first thing in the, in the story, wasn't it? Wrecking, yeah. wrecking the ship, and then uh, yeah, it's kind of cool. Here it is at the end. Hello, beastie. Hello. <laughs> Wasn't talking <laughs> to you. Okay. I am beast. <clears throat> Where should I go? Nowhere good Backwards. to go. Up here. Yeah, yeah, I could go sort of up there, but I feel like I'll be blocked by a bunch of things if I'm up there. Yeah. Ooh. Not the high ground there. though. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna just try here for now. We'll see. Oh, here we go. Fate of the small. Oh, fine. He's got another. He's got. Yeah, it is. I thought it was a name. The Salomon. Oh, hello. Oh, yeah, it is just a bunch of characters that we have killed, I guess. Oh, no. Source infused. Um, okay. Well, I guess I should have kept my daggers. <laughs> okay, fine. Um, I'm gonna do this. For a little bit of. Yeah. Right. Um, Gosh, Vayne needs a better shield. Boom, 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 boom! Yeah, very nice. What do you got, Brackus? Oh, fire. not the tentacles again. <laughs> I don't think we're going to be escaping the tentacles. Ow. Well. Hmm. That sucks. I'll fix that. Do we still have a fire immunity stuff? Did we use it? Um... 
Oh, we should also use our tea. Yeah, I was just thinking that. Yeah. We have medium resist all potions. I, oh, I do have a couple fire resist potions. Yes, alright. Yeah, I like our way to the necrofire. That's very nice. Perfect. Where is. Oh, there he is. Sallow man, more like sallow dumb. Am I right? <laughs> 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 uh, beast, dang it. Oh, here we go. That might create a little steam. Oh, it didn't get rid of all the fire. It's annoying. That's weird. Yeah. Alright, well, what if I do that? Mine is even plague. Ew. Ooh, gross. Can be cured with blast steam, steam lance, cleanse wounds. Dang it! I just used cleanse wounds. <laughs> Ooh, look at all my APs. Dang yeah. it. Everybody's too far away to do anything except the Salaman. Oh, Dallas died. Rip. Well, unconscious. So I must need them yeah. for um. Yeah, maybe they are they are gonna come back to life probably. Yeah, for some sort of cutscene or something. Yeah. Well, um Wait, assassinate is Oh. When performed from stealth, 50% damage increase. Can I stealth right now? Wow, I can. Oh. But now I don't have enough action points. <laughs> <laughs> well that's Dumb. A flawless plan, <laughs> uh, part with, with one. I had so many action points. Wait, maybe I can fix this. Where's my other T? Where's the dang turning other T? I have okay. white T, and then I had another T that was different. Oh, there it is. Green T. Aha! Uh Aha! -huh. Uh -huh. I don't have any tea. That's weird. How come you've got tea and I don't? I freaking missed. Um, oh, you missed? I don't know. Oh. Um, hold on. I don't know. You, I didn't use my tea. Maybe you used yours. I remember. Maybe I just drank it. You know, you know I'm British. <laughs> yeah, you just automatically drank it without thinking about it. <laughs> um. Well, I missed anyway, so that was great. Over here. Yes, well. Okay. Ow. Oh God. Two is bales. I guess Fire Barney would probably be the best huh, for this fight. Possibly. Because he'll be immune yeah, he's gonna to attack, everything, yeah. and they're also weak to it. Oh. Um, well, I'll get him back in four turns. <clears throat> okay, well, it's not that bad. Ow. 
Ooh. Hmm, that's really annoying, huh? But yeah. Ow! Sorry, sorry, but, you know... I, I don't have magic armor! I know. I'll heal. So I could do that. Oh god. What? Well, my camera just freaked out. It's moving around. Oh god. Uh. Okay. Shocked, shocked, and stunned. Oof, that's a bit much, isn't it? Stop Ooh. that. Okay, beast. Um. Let's see. No more flag. Oh, he's immune to charms. That makes sense. Fair. Oh boy. Well, he's here. Should we hit him while he's here? I don't know. Yes. Target is too far. Oh, target is too far. It's one of those things where it looks like I'm going to target him, but then it like fails. Um, hmm. Hmm. Mm. There's the dumb sallow man there he is. Okay. See, I just feel like, you know, he's probably just going to keep summoning all these guys repeatedly. He might, Harry might just do a fine item out. We just don't know. It's one of those things we'll have to test. I wish we could hit Brachus, that would be more satisfying. He might, he might, it looks like he's equipped for melee. Yeah, he's got a giant axe thing. So he's probably going to come over here pretty soon. Well, that's nice. No, that's the... Yeah, target is too far. Yeah, I don't know whether we can actually hit that. Weird I could hit him with a couple different spells. I just kind of chose not to because none of them were very good. Hmm. He's pretty scary looking from this angle. Oh, Jeffrey. Jeffrey. <laughs> she can't see through the steam. Yeah, that's, that was my plan, really. Here you go. Flay skin on the boneless yeah. spider. <laughs> Alright. Alright, then. Uh, so, Alose can... How in the God's name is he too far away? He's a giant target right in front of you. Yeah, I don't, I don't know whether he's, yeah, whether he'll if... die when um, Rex dies. Yeah. But if that's the case, why give yeah, him stats? Exactly. Maybe he'll do something later that'll bring him in or something. I don't know. I think I'll try and um, maybe I can hit. Brachus from over here? Uh, hey, good shot. Hit him. I know. I did. I know. Yep. Okay. What else can we do? Ballistic shot. Oh, nice. Crit. He is awesome. Reactive shot. Ricochet. Eh. Aha. 
cackles. Don't kill me! Ah! Okay. <laughs> oh god. How oh, dare. How much dare. Okay. Community. That's fine. I don't understand why we keep falling over. No, I don't either. Hmm. Yes. Very good. Yeah, so the Kraken got hit by that, so... He did. <laughs> yeah, AoEs seem to work. Apparently I can hit Brachus from here. I... Do not question. I just feel like it might miss, though, and even though it tells me that I can hit him, I, I don't... It will. Trust, trust the game. Trust the game. Think so? Yep. Okay. There you go. Oh, yeah, it worked. Okay. Oh, God, Fane, why? Yeah, Fane's... Yes. So hard to get his magic armor and stuff back up, but I don't have a way. Oh, I know. No. I wish he had a better shield. Um, um. Can I do anything else? Let's see. Let's... I can do Bloodsucker, but that probably won't really help, because I can't see any blood. <laughs> if only I could heal Fane, that would be grand. Well, I can do this. I mean, it might save his life. Yes. Who knows? He's more likely to get hit by magic, nope. maybe. Uh, ooh. That didn't do anything? That missed. It did. It stunned, it stunned Red Prince. Ah, uh, okay. There we go. Okay, that might have saved him, actually. It did, yeah. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Come on, get up. Get, oh. <laughs> what the heck is that? A, is that a bug? It must be a bug. It's so weird. Yeah, it is. It's bugged out. Oh, there we go. We got there in the end. Yeah. Pop all your potions, I guess? I don't know. You guys, you two deal with, with <laughs> Jeffrey. It's because that like smoke is there. They don't know what to do, so they're yeah. just like, oh, "We're just gonna go nice. kill this guy." <clears throat> Ill uh, AI manipulation. Yeah. All right. So, hmm, I wonder if Brackus is immune to being charmed. Probably. Yeah, he say. will be. Hang on. It, uh, it, no immunities. Oh. No immunities, it says. It might be a hidden immunity, though. No, uh, it says none. I would take that no, as... He is a boss boss. He says none. It says none. You have too much faith in this game. Where's my other dagger? What? <gasps> oh. Oh, God, that scared me. Oh, you dropped it? Yeah, I thought I lost it. It just looks really different. I forgot. Okay. Um, got my daggers back on. Ah! Almost got rid. I was trying to get rid of this. Every every attack, every single time, you're like, ah, no! Ah! It, it never does the thing that I want. But actually, that worked out. That was good. Yes. Yes. Well. More. Oh my god. He said, again. <laughs> it's alright. 
And then Brackus walked to a corner, hurting himself more. Yeah. That's fine. Look at all that blood. Yeah. He's like, me tendons! My undead tendons are bleeding. <laughs> Don't. Don't. Don't question. <laughs> Don't question it. It's fine. Come on, get up. Get up, beast. Get up. There you go. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Um... Is Sallow Man Guy still alive? No. no. Okay, so we've got just the Isbales and Brackus. And the Kraken. Don't forget the... <laughs> well, yeah, but we can't really... Don't forget the Kraken! Should I shoot him with more magic? Can't really hit him, I don't think. Nah, I'll leave it. Uh, can't. We need more magic armor, that's what we need. Yeah. I can hit... You and Beast. Thanks. I'd rather you didn't. With a positive spell. Oh, we didn't say that, did you? You were just like, right. With magic armor. I... <laughs> yeah. What happens if I do global cooling on fire? Probably nothing. I wouldn't try anything new at this stage. Yeah. I could do arcane stitch, which would... Let's see. Restores target magic armor, removes frozen stun, petrified. Yeah. <sighs> okay, well, I'm gonna do this first. I just am kind of in an annoying spot. We'll see what this guy does. Oh yeah, there we go. Another is deal. Yeah. Maybe a lot of poison damage and stuff. But not too bad. Yeah. Hmm. That's okay. That's, that's alright as well? Or is that just like, uh... Stop it! It's uh, a lot of debuffs. <laughs> yeah, but was... Curse just does, like, resistances and stuff. I mean, accuracy. I mean... Eh. God damn it. Okay, I'm going for Brackus. If I can. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Uh, crap. Do I still have my tea? I still have my tea for one turn. You haven't thrown it in a bay yet. Okay, that's cool. I have not. Can I do a <laughs> tactical retreat? Very funny joke, by the way. Very funny. Well, I'm just... just no game. I'm behind a, a, him. American relying on tea. I'm just... <clears throat> game? No. Jerk. no. What's he doing? Saying I'm not behind him. But it's totally lying. Got a pixel. Ugh. Ooh. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Pretty cool. They both move nice. Yep. All right. Let's see. One thousand. You be quiet, Kraken. It's not your turn yet. <laughs> yeah, you wait your turn. He's all turn. like. <laughs> 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 Fire damage. All right. Uh, oh boy, I don't know which one of these is gonna do more. I'm dead, Probably by the way. This? Yeah, I know you are. I'm just dead. Oh, you're dead too. Oh crap! I did not realize. That I either. didn't realize that until just now. I don't know what happened. Uh oh no. Sorry. You get. Oh god! Come on! Oh wait. Yes. No. Oh. <sighs> it's off. All right, bye. Bye, Kraken. Ah, good. The uh, damn, bro, achievement. Nice. Well done. All right. Oh. oh. Hey, you were right. Yeah. I knew that. You mind, um... Oh. Ah, wait a minute. Oh, crap. He's talking to me. Yeah, I can't get in on this. I can't see anything. <laughs> what if you double-click my portrait? Does that work? Nope. I am locked out of this because my characters are dead. Well done, game. Oh, my God. Well, loose and stocking saying that he never possessed the Master of Source and he can only hope that our choice is wise. 
and he's made mistakes, but with wisdom and truth, there are still values to believe in and blah, 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 blah. Continue. <sighs> Dallas is in pain. Good. This is ridiculous. Okay. Basically, they're just saying, oh, woe is us. You have to save the day now because we're dead. Good. Well, then. And that was, that oh, was it. This is, hey. as they say, it. Right. Okay. I will remember you, you know. And to be remembered by an eternal god is, in its own way, a special sort of immortality. I don't like how I was dead at the end there. There's something very yeah. indignant about that, you know. I don't even know how I died. I don't know either. I missed it. Yeah, I missed it. I mean, it, it, the, the the Kraken did, like, the poison thing. And I was like, okay, well, that's kind of happened. And, and then it was your girl. You, was were dead. you, like, maybe it was your turn, but you were, like, you were sleeping or knocked out or something? And so it skipped you? And then you took poison damage over time or something? I don't know. I know. Of course, in a much more mundane, practical sense, you will be dead. But I gather you creatures are very susceptible to simple platitudes. Oh. Um, wow. Turning against us? Well, he's not really, is he? Oh. I don't know. It's been a good time, Fane. Fane looks at you grimly, even for a skull. I will take no pleasure in this. You think back on your journey but here. But Fane! Oh, bye. On all you have seen. On how the Magisters hunted sorcerers who committed horrible crimes and purge sorcerers who only tried to heal the sick. You think of how the Eternals unleashed void-woken horror on the world in an effort to reclaim it. You look at the source around you. You know that within your reach is divinity. You think of what you could Original do with such you. power. Seeing the vast quantity <laughs> of source in front of you, you think you should be able to handle a couple of void-woken. You think of your personal problems. It's time to make a choice. A choice that decides the fate of Rivalon and uh -oh. of you. Yeah, bye, Fane. Yeah, what the heck? Fane just leaves? Oh. <sighs> Maybe someone will say, you didn't talk to me enough, but I've tried several times, and every time it's like, no time for idle chit chat. So I yeah, don't I know. It. Yeah, I know. I, so. I think it's probably because it's just Fane and he's like part of the story thing. Oh, I don't know. It's weird because, you know. know. The connection between him and Dallas and everything, and then... Right, you'd think he would want this, but... Mm -hmm. I don't know. Maybe... There's also that weird thing about him belonging to you and then coming over to me, but then neither of us can talk to him. And... I think it might be like a story thing where he... We don't know that... We don't know as much about him as we think we do, maybe? Where do you okay. stand? Okay, um, anyways, I kind of... If I refuse it, are you going to get a chance to do it? Because that's what I kind of want to happen. I I don't But well, I want it. I accept it. I'm I know, but it's asking me. You're not having the no. same conversation, right? Okay. Yeah, well, yeah. We're having it at the same time, I but think. But it's but it's Oh, is it is he talking to you on your yes. screen? Yes. Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought it was just me. All right. So he's asking where do you stand? Um, yes. So we both have to make this this decision at the same time. So I kind of like that. So we can't, you know. So I'm going to put what, what I'm going to put and you're going to put what you're going to put. Right? Yeah. It's a shame that it, it launches straight into this. I'd prefer it, like, to save it just as Rackers Rex dies. Maybe it did. Yeah. You never know. And then we can, like, have a couple of goes at this and see what happens. Your yeah. choice you can't is save it made. during dialogue, right? Uh, you oh, you can. can. I didn't think okay. you could do that, Orin. Right. All right. Okay. All right. I'm going to try saying refuse it. The world after fades and twists and mutates. You're in the Hall of Echoes now. It reshapes uh, itself around you. With fear. Those who stood with you or against yeah. you are no longer there. But you know they cannot be far. This is where you shall decide once and for all, by trial of combat, who shall ascend. Trial by combat? This is where you die or become divine. This is the greatest battle of them all. Uh... Oh, so it's us against, us against fate. Well, pfft. I mean, he doesn't even have a good shield. He does, though. <laughs> he does have a good shield. I just don't know why it's not. It doesn't give him a lot of armor, though. Well, maybe not as good as yours, but... Yeah. Okay. This is the greatest uh, battle of them all. Well, there's a portal there. I guess because he want, he wants to to ascend as well. 
Yeah, he's an ascendant. So are you. I am not. Competing this to seize the powers of divinity. So us three are helping you ascend, and he's by himself. That's very kind of you, thanks. Mind you, you just want rid of me, don't you, pretty much? I uh, may I remember you when you when I'm a god. I'll decide. <laughs> uh, Lose just wants to, you know, go about having a good time and being rid of her inner demons. Yeah. And she wants to go be a bard and have fun. Um, I am going to go up here. And then I'm going to use more tea. More tea. More tea. Yes. Wow, I have so much AP right now. Can I reach you guys? Uh, yeah. Oh, now he <laughs> now he <laughs> blocks. <laughs> now yep. he blocks. Ah, uh, game. Uh, does, he, does he still have the same uh, stats? Yeah, he's got a ten percent chance to block anything, and he never has until this point. <laughs> until Lose throws a dagger at him. Oh, it's amazing. Doesn't seem like a very fair fight. Honestly. No, but it could be two versus two here, couldn't it? Yeah. Depending on what you you answer, you could have been on Fane's side. That's true. Or maybe I would be on my own side. Of course. Maybe. Yeah, because I would weird. be fighting Fane too. Yeah, so it would be like um, three. This is three, and then Fane would be, uh, sorry, Beast would be on your side, maybe, probably. Except it's me, so it'd be on my side, I don't know. No idea. We'd all be against each other, because we all want to be cool. You know, Beast doesn't, does he? So, he's the only one we didn't. <gasps> Hello! Your, your, then, your damage output is immense. It's absolutely crazy. Oh, he's gonna die by running up there, you moron. <laughs> After all that you have oh. Oh my God, all that the you AI. Have done, all that you have become, <sighs> the Aetheon <Akeon> lies <laughs> so in dumb. front of you. Divinity is yours to take. <sighs> oh my God, facepalm game. Oh look, I'm on my throne. Oh look, oh boy. Can't see you because the text box is too yeah, big. Yeah, no problem there. <laughs> Or we're talking. We're chatting. What you do next decides your own fate and the future of the world. What shall you do with divinity? What shall you do? Uh, I am going to become the new god walker and become its new divine. All right. Fulfill your destiny. Ooh! And so it ended. A tale that began with my own ill-fated attempt to rid the world of the god -woke. A new divine rose, a true heir to the seven, more powerful than ever. Yeah. A united rhythm yeah. battle against the void. 
All across the realm, he was loved, worshipped, and adored. Oh, yeah. Humans, lizards, elves, and dwarves all rallied to his banner. The Great Allegiance stood once more, but the war continued. From the depths of the void, the God King still sought to return. Yeah, you gotta have that little. As for me, my last hope of ever being freed of the God King's terrible tyranny faded when the God woke and claimed divinity. An eternity of pain and suffering is mine. I cling now to the dream that one day the veil will be sealed, that one day I can be freed, that one day a new God woken will rise. Oh, oh, okay. Oh. What was her name again? Yeah. Old, old lady that we killed like four times? The Wendigo. The Wendigo, yeah, that's it. That's it, yeah. Okay, well, now you are, uh. You're using spirit vision? Um, uh, I'm glowy. You're very glowy. So, why are we here? <laughs> I don't know. I <laughs> thought I'd, like, be gone into the ether and yet. Is well, this just where the game puts you, like in case you want to do something else, or? But we can talk to we can talk, talk to, to Melody. Melody. We can talk yeah. to someone else down here. I don't see where they are. Oh, there we go, Beast. Okay, Tarquin. Oh my God. Maybe now he'll make the sword for us since we beat the game. <laughs> <laughs> talk to Melody. Um, I will. Melody stands tall and proud, sunlight sparkling off her mask. From here, she looks almost. Angelic. Well, here we are again. You, me, and the ship I've saved from ruin for your personal benefit. I'd say you owe me. But why state the obvious? Get an eyeful, your holiness. I expect it's the last we'll see of each other for some time. She turns to you, arms crossed, and grins. Look at you. Magnificent. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's what you wanted. Well, lady, sure. you, you, know, you don't look too bad yourself. You know? <laughs> Actually, I've never looked better. Except for one small thing. She fingers the mask covering her face. For a moment, it seems as though she's about to remove it. But instead, she places a hand on your shoulder. We've come a long way together. I did my best by you all the way. I sacrificed much. I'd give even more to see you become exactly what you've become. Soon, I'd like to have a little chat about something you can do for me. But, I believe that can wait. Relax. Enjoy. I certainly plan to do the same. Uh, where are you off to? Oh, I don't know. Around and about. Treat myself to some mead, a level 300. I'd say we've earned it. And when the time comes, I'll come find you. Your holiness. Yes, my ho holiness. Yes. Your holiness. Glowy I am! You're so glowy. I am so glowy! Yes, indeed. Okay. Alright. Uh... That beast up here. Oh, you guys talk to him first? Okay, sorry. Yeah, I want to talk to Tarquin because I don't like him. Okay. That makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you should talk to Melody as well. Yeah. Remind him that he's speaking of the new divine. Perhaps you ought to afford some new... more respect. Yeah! My respect has to be earned. Unexpected. I hope our new divine is capable of humility. No. I would hate to think that I helped usher another tyrant into the world. Hmm. What do you do now? That is the question, isn't it? How does one top the greatest feat of necromancy ever conceived? I might have the answer to that. Tell me, have you ever heard of Gustafjan? No. No, of course you wouldn't. It's a written language, unreadable to most but myself, naturally. It comes from a mysterious race from another world. Beings that feed on minds. Illithids! Yeah. Mind flares. I intend to seek them out. 
This Gustafjan seems to guard portals to their realm. And once I've uncovered one, well, why settle for being the greatest mind in just one world when there's another for the taking? Okay, well, that's great. Okay. Right. <laughs> okay. Let me talk to him. Well, there you go. It isn't the new divine gracing me with his presence. Oh, yeah, and we'll just do the same kind of thing, won't we? Yeah. yeah. Oh, you got to sell. Yeah, okay, let's have a look. <laughs> uh, what do you mean, uh? Tarquin. Uh. He's such a jerk. I wish we could kill him. Uh, um. Well. Where have you gone? I went to talk to Beast. Because we could kill him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a god, you know. I can do what I want now. Yeah, you could just sentence him to live his life out its, in the sea, in the middle of the ocean. Yeah, in fact, you're going to stay here forever on your own. Yeah. You chat to Beast. Divinity has ascended. Can you believe it? Seems like we've been adventuring forever minus a day. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's been like two years. <laughs> it has been two years. <laughs> uh, one, one story for the road? He eyes you slyly, but consents to one final tale. The beast of the sea rose triumphant, guiding his fellow godwoken from an island prison to a final hurrah. He boarded the Lady Vengeance. Now, inexplicably whole due to magic a beast could never understand, and returned to his homeland. Then began the process of rebuilding, restoring trust, handing out hope, serving his people. Huh. Guess that one doesn't really end with a bang. But that's all right. You know, it's a work in progress. <coughs> First okay. draft. Good. So he's gonna, he's gonna go back to his detritus from his beard, sand, skin, and whatever yeah, else might have cool. accumulated there. He takes a deep breath when he sees you. I know it's the same old sea breeze I've always smelled, but it's it's different now. Chatting to him. I don't know how to explain. Maybe you do, oh divine one. <laughs> I can I can ask him to kneel <laughs> in the presence of the new divine. <laughs> um. A lot has happened. And who'd have thought it? You're not the collared landlubber I first met, that's for sure. I'm looking at him. You belong to Rivalon. <laughs> Beast begins to chuckle, then guffaw, and soon he is laughing as heartily as you've ever known him to. <laughs> ah, that might be the most dramatic thing I've said in ages. The laugh fades away, and the concerns of a kingdom and beyond pass between the two of you. Are you afraid of what comes next? Uh, that's what I should be asking you. I'm not afraid of what I know. I've got to go back to the kingdom. There's a lot to do there. Damage that needs undone. Dwarves have lived in fear for too long on the outside and the inside. Something tells me it's all going to be okay. He winks and begins to sing. Oh, here we go. As if, as if you singing. You, you've, this is your fault. This is your influence. <laughs> yeah, it's a good influence. Here, here the wild beast just sails on the ocean. He's docked in the bay and coming your way. Off on the yawn, you hear the commotion. He's docked in the bay and coming your way. There's a better song than yours. Hey. The cupboard can't That's my... <laughs> nor can your birth. His daggers don't care about the gold that you're worth. He'll bury your bones neath a mountain of earth. He's docked in the bay and coming your way. He pauses, then continues to hum, all the while working his whiskers. Yeah, that's way better than yours. No, it's not. You're just jealous of my talents. What about, what about Han? Yeah, the most important person on this whole ship. Just, he gave us some lockpicks and stuff. You just... <laughs> You're the new divine. That's so cool. What's it Flex like? your biceps. <laughs> Spread the world is nice and I have its pearl. Oh, that's <laughs> more than I thought it would. 
<laughs> There's also the matter of my payment for all the stuff I've done for you. Uh -huh. That will be... He taps his fingers and mouths silently while he counts, until he arrives at an acceptable figure. Thirteen hundred thousand dozen and fifty-teen gold pieces. Now pay up. Uh, not a real number. It is so. But if you can't pay me in money, then I'll just have to insist you keep me on until you can. So, what position can you offer? Give me my spy. Dig up dirt on, on my enemies. Pan ponders your suggestion for all of a second. Okay, I love being all sneaky and shh. Yeah. Uh, well, yeah. But you better believe the bill for that will be a doozy. Uh huh. Eleven to ten thousand teddy bears. Yep. Teddy bears hey. are worth a lot. All right. Well, I think that's it. You got like below Jack, just in case. You can't. He says there's nothing down there. Oh. What a strange ending, though. There's nothing yeah. interesting down there. The future lies above, not below. Jones. Quite interesting, oh. indeed. <laughs> Alright, then. Don't be a stranger now. Hi, on. What? I'm going to talk to the dragon ship's head. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can't. Well, maybe. Yeah, maybe you gotta go, go towards it a little bit. No. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you can. Oh, there's also a Spirit of Fane! There you go. Um, do you want to or should I? Uh, you talk. You're the so, dude, so... That's it. We're gone. I failed them. The world is yours now. I pray you'll treat it better than me. Okay. Oh! Oh, snap! Well, wow. double crosser. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was. <laughs> that was pretty rude. <laughs> Alright, dragon head. I am here to serve, Master. In this realm and any other, for as long as I must. Um, glad to be aboard. Lady Vengeance is a being a dependable ally. So, so it's also been destroyed like fifteen times within the game. Yeah. <laughs> I am bidden to serve you, as promised once and promised eternal. And so, as always, I am at the ready. Time to depart. There we go. You look out to the endless beyond. The sun's light plays upon the waves, just as it always did. The sails flutter in the wind, just as they always will. And yet, something is different. You are different. And with yeah. a start, you realize where you must go next. You speak the command to the Lady Vengeance, and another chapter begins. There we go. Are you ready? <laughs> I'm ready. Here we go. War raged on. The ancient empire of lizards became one of the pillars of the new divine alliance. The houses of war and of shadows were particularly useful in the fight against the god king. The empire used the war to expand its territory. Justinia returned to her throne. Under her rule, the Dwarven Kingdom fought for the Divine, and her loyalty was unquestionable. Many fine and courageous Dwarves did their people great honor in battle and in death. With Lucian gone, the Elves reluctantly rejoined the Divine Alliance. Their place in the War on the Void would entirely depend on the integrity of the new Divine. And here and there, across the world, what was left of the Black Ring fought on. The island of Fort Joy remained a sorcerer's paradise, a place of exile for those whose sorcery threatened to bring in the void. For their well-being, 
its residents depended entirely on the benevolence of the new divine. Reaper's coast struggled on. The farms and the fisheries fought to feed the people against the void-woken blight. The black pits took fire. The oil there burns still. Driftwood teetered on the edge of starvation until the night the void woken came from the sea. All were killed. This did, however, put an end to the famine. <laughs> <coughs> the nameless isle had vanished. Although only open water remained, by instinct, ships would steer clear. None of the captains could articulate why. Young Han grew up a warrior and became one of the Alliance's greatest generals. But even he could not win the war. Almira and Mihaili settled in an abandoned homestead. The locals liked and respected Almira. She never wanted for help, and deals always fell to her favor. Outsiders were often suspicious, but no local would speak against her. With a new divine at the helm, Malady had a powerful ally, but she was in no hurry to call in her favor. After all, it might be the last thing she ever did. Having performed the greatest act of necromancy in history, Tarquin found the new world unchallenging. He became obsessed with rumors of another plane of existence. One day he vanished and was never seen again. Ahu the wizard served the new divine with honor, wisdom, and an at times unnerving feline elegance. Sahela sought to strengthen the Elven Alliance with the new divine. Her powers of sight proved useful in the ongoing war against the Void, but she could never be sure that the new divine trusted her. Tova, her mother, was Sahela's most trusted warrior. The Beast of the Sea returned to the Dwarven Kingdom to lead the Dwarves in the fight against the Void. After a series of public blunders, Marcus eschewed political power and returned to the sea. The Beast and the Lady Vengeance sail on. Losa returned to her music and enjoyed a storied career as the Divine's premier musician. Dark moods would still overtake her and she would spend long hours walking in the wilds. She always returned with a new song. And then there was you. And you, the Red Prince, the Lizard Divine. What did you do with your power? What kind of divine were you as the world battled on? Did you show mercy or strength? Did you sacrifice others as Lucian had done? Did you regret becoming divine? Did you wish you'd surrendered the power that runs through your veins and sealed the veil? Only you know the truth. Only you know if you atone for your sins. Well, there you have it. I was the main player the whole time. You were definitely the damage dealer. <laughs> yeah. Those, those daggers of yours. They Oof. were pretty, pretty amazing in the end. In the they beginning were. of the game, they were not, but they really got strong in the end. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. That was <sighs> a weird ending thing for, for multiplayer. I think it was a little weird. Yeah. But, uh, pretty cool. End of an era. 
Yeah. Sure, we've, we've been doing these games for about four years now or something. Yep, started with Divinity Original Sin. <sighs> yeah, in like and... 1987. <laughs> hey, that's the year I was born. <laughs> Makes sense. That's when it began. <laughs> that's when we started playing. Um, yeah, yeah, long time. Very long time. It's sad now that the, now that's over. There's no more Divinity. No. Every week. <laughs> no. Um, and of course, we did the classic edition because they released the um, definitive edition, mm -hmm. a, a, like a couple of months after we started. Obviously, yep. With the improved uh, journal. Lots of improvements, I think, but Which, that's fine because yeah. if we ever, you know, want to play the game again on our own, then we ha then we can play that, mm -hmm. that version. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and a bad journal would be. Yeah, would be good. The er original journal is definitely a weak point for sure. Yeah, I'd say, I'd, I'd say so. Yeah, it was kind of hard to to, to um. Kind of sound like what what. I know I know we played it quite sporadically, which didn't help. Yeah. But um, yeah, piecing everything together with everything that it was, was going the, on in the journal was. Yeah, it was just very hard to use the journal at all because it's just kind of a mess. Yeah, so we, we left a lot of uh, stones unturned, if you like, you know, and didn't do a couple of quests that we kind of intended to, I guess. Yeah, and, I mean, uh, I'm n I'm never one of those players who want to do literally everything in a game. No, no, but there was there was a couple in there like uh, like the dwarf thing with the death fog. We never yeah. finished that quest, and and the whole thing with uh, Anathema with Tarquin and the sword. We never don't know yeah. what was up with that. That didn't happen that either. Tarquin thing. That's the only thing that bothered me. That like, because mm -hmm. it was just a really big like weird plot hole the whole time. Just just there, wasn't it? It was just like hanging. It's like, like oh, is it finished yet? No, it's not finished. It's finished yet? No, it's like we're at the end of the game, Tarquin. Where the hell is the sword? Yeah, there should be a something there that kind of makes. I don't know what we missed closure. there. We missed even, a lot. Even if you I think. fail, there should be some kind of closure. I don't know. We missed a lot, but we still managed to, to bumble through, and uh, yeah, and we did good. And we, we did, did, yeah, we did, we did. I, I think so, anyway. You know, all in all, we managed we to finish the did. game. It was yeah. really good how how they managed to like bring more into every fight. Like every fight was different. Like oh now you know. Yes, yes, that was good. Yeah, they they managed it's to. to it never got samey. We ne we all, yeah. we're always thinking like, oh, what's gonna happen now type thing. Yeah, they did a really good job on that. Every yeah. boss fight was unique. Yeah, yeah. the combat was really good. Really enjoyable. It was so good, yeah. Very, very fun. Definitely just a direct upgrade from Divinity Original Sin. Yeah, yeah, it was. It was much harder to misclick. Yeah, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> that drove us insane in the first game. Like, so many action points were wasted. <laughs> So yeah, many we, entire turns were wasted. We got through that as well. We did, yeah. yeah. Um, it's been great, and uh, thanks everybody who stuck with us for, yeah. for all of this. Yeah, thank you. It's been it's a long, been... A long time, and I know, I know we might not have been the the, more, <laughs> the easiest to watch, like forgetting <laughs> things and misunderstanding things and misremembering things and everything like that. Yeah, because um, we play it every week. Sometimes we take a few weeks off because of life. And yeah. So. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah, the way that we uh, yeah played it just just led to this, this really sort of long period of playing it, and it's one of those games that that that, that keeps referring to things that happened years ago, <laughs> like literally years ago. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. And and so it's very hard to to piece everything together when you play like that. Yep. It but is, it, but it is what it is. It's one of those games that is fun anyway, though. Like, even if you don't know every single thing that's going on, mm -hmm. just the gameplay itself is so enjoyable either way. Yeah, I never loaded the game thinking, yeah, I don't really want to do this. It yeah, was me always, either. It was always the, oh, I wonder what's going to be, uh, you know, what's, what's coming next? What's the next fight going to be tall? When's the next loot going to come? And things like that. Yeah, it was yeah. great at doing that. The, the advancement of the characters was really... And we were very rarely really stuck, like, even though... Uh, just like, the like... puzzle that was it yeah right? yeah 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 sometimes but we never like I wonder where we're going to go now there's always somewhere else to explore and something else to do right there was yeah. only that bit with the painting you know, towards the end there were some silly puzzles but whatever and uh yeah it makes sense like they, they put the the painting just goes to the Venge Lady Vengeance stash which Hope, is a good yeah. 
yeah, we needed that. <laughs> yes, we did. Otherwise, we'll be able to finish the game. I've well, to rewatch yeah. hours and hours of footage to see where I put that. I'm sure. Thing. Yeah, and imagine if you if you hadn't recorded it, or if you're playing by yourself, you would have no idea. Yeah. Um. So that's a good thing that they did that. <laughs> it is. It certainly is. Yeah. Or they, you know, they could have improved that upon that by like making that item undroppable or mm. something, you know, yeah. and just make it weigh nothing. Like, a lot of games do that. Yeah, like, like put, I... put a super thing into, like, quest items. Yeah. It's kind of a necessary or... evil, isn't it, of, of, of games? Yeah, because then it's a sort of a spoiler, because you know it's for something, but... And, like, I get why they didn't do yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. But it yeah, definitely... Back it's a little dangerous. Yeah. <laughs> it is, yes. But I, I, I enjoyed it a lot. It's been a, been a... Me too. Loved it. Pleasure. Okay. Every time it was super fun. Yeah, yeah, it was. I wonder, wonder what if anything will be next. Hmm? Yes, what will be next? I don't know. We're still talking about it. We haven't exactly decided. So, but there'll yeah. be something. We've they'll... decided there'll be something. Yeah, yeah. Because this is like a <clears throat> a habit for both of us now, I suppose, isn't it? You know, to get together once mm -hmm. a week and play a game. Yeah, it is. It's, uh, it's definitely a habit. It's... <laughs> Maybe a bad habit, but even so. <laughs> nah, it's a good habit, I think. <laughs> it breaks things up, and it's good to play a game with somebody else. Especially for me, because I never really like, play games with other people, ever. Yeah, and, you, and you're playing games so, so often on streams right. and LPs and such. You do you play games a lot more than me, so... Yeah, it's nice to break that up a little bit. Breaks up. Good mm -hmm. stuff. Yeah, good. Glad. How do you feel about, about Los A... Uh, being my bard. Hmm? Yeah, well, it's I suppose it she depends. would sing about sort of our adventures together, wouldn't she? Because yeah. you were the you were you were the damage dealer towards the end, especially you know you were you were. Yeah, I I carried the team damage wise at the end. Hmm. But uh, I don't know. I feel like Lose, she seems more of like a free spirit type to me. Yes, yeah, so I think I think that our characters developed and, and and kind of ended in the way that we thought they would and should. Yeah. With with because you 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 got rid of your demons, didn't you? I did. Um, yeah. And uh, so it was just left to me to to become the divine. And I, I, even even at the start, I even, like I even thought that would be a thing. I was I was like, my character's like super important. And <laughs> yeah, it turned out great. Yeah. It turned it out great. that he was. In the end, mm -hmm. he was like super super important. But yeah, yeah, I enjoyed actually. playing as the Red Prince. I enjoyed it. Uh, <laughs> I know. I enjoyed did. his character. <laughs> and, yeah. It was a fun character. Yeah. Ooh. Yes. Is this your song? I don't know. It doesn't sound familiar yet. Does it? Oh, maybe it is. Yeah, it's just a dude singing it. Yeah, it is. It yeah. is your song, isn't it? It is. Yeah. Yeah, when you would say, we're, we're in this cell that's like covered in buboes and stuff, and you're like, let's <laughs> have a sing song. Well, yeah, that's what bards do. <laughs> that's like that a really so random, hard. random place to do it. It was so, so bizarre. It's the best place to do it because yeah. it's you know in the darkest times um, you could need a song. Yeah, it was. It was after that fight with the uh, the doctor, which was I think one of the hardest fights in the game, wasn't it for us? Oh yeah. That was pretty, pretty tough. There was that, and there was that one um, in, in the tomb against. We, we were sort of like low down, and yep. that 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 was connected with, with Fane the... again. It was so long ago. Yeah, gosh, I know. I forgot a lot of stuff already. Yeah, yeah. There's so many <laughs> good, you know, points about this game, but mm -hmm. sadly because we played it over two years, <laughs> it's really <laughs> hard to pinpoint any of them. <laughs> Which was yeah. your favorite part? I don't even know. Honestly, I can say for sure that I had a lot more fun like the second half of the game just because my cuz Lose became a lot stronger mm. and we started getting like good gear and um stuff like that. There was a really long point in the let's play where Lose had like really crap gear mm. for a really long time. That's right. So, and then you suddenly started getting all this really nice yeah. stuff. So maybe a couple of balancing issues there. Yeah, so that was 
for me, that was when I had the most fun, right? When we started getting some awesome upgrades and uh, Beast got some really cool spells and he started being able to do a lot of like air damage and whatnot. Mm. That was fun too. Yeah, I think I think for me, like, I plateaued pretty quickly because I put everything into one skill, which I think was a mistake. So I was like, all oh, into really summoning. Powerful, I know, though. but um, it got to the point where I'm like, well, I'm kind of like, I should have like, once I'd got Barney like really zooped up, I should have then yeah. gone into something else. But I didn't yeah. really, I just sort of like, potted about with different things here and there. So having a, a second skill for uh, Red Prince, I think would have been, you know, let me do more things. Because I was just like, well, I'm going to summon Barney and then, well, I guess I'll put turrets everywhere. And, and that was sort of it. Yeah. Um, yeah, I could see that. Like unless, maybe fire unless... or something would have been kind of cool. Yeah, yeah, definitely fire. I'd say yeah. with uh, with the way that you know he breathes fire, so you're getting some pyro. Of you know, if I play it again, oh well, you know that's that's probably what I would do. Yeah, because that was like one of the only things we didn't have pyro. Yeah, which is which is, I did like that though because the the, the first time round when we played the first game, we were mm -hmm. really heavy into, um, pyro, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. and um, bows and stuff. And we didn't yep. really... I know you had a bow, but it wasn't really a primary weapon. It was like, I'll use it for now, but then only because I don't have anything else to do type thing. Yeah. So we went, right. we veered away from what we knew in the first game. Yeah, exactly. It was it was nice. And we did that on purpose. Because yeah. we had a whole lot of fire in the first game. We did have a lot <laughs> like, of fire. Let's do something different. Yeah. It worked. But summons are always good. You, you know, summons are... I really liked the additional... Um, like sort of classes or whatever you call them in this game. They were really fun. Like the, the polymorph was really cool to use along with the rogue skills. Yeah. And the summoning one that you had was super, really strong and had a lot of cool stuff. Yeah. Yeah. And there was, there was things we missed as well. Cause you know, like with, with Barney, I know you, you can forge things to give him oh. skills. Oh, wow. Using, using sauce cool. and stuff like that. I never really got into the crafting thing, but there was all that hell element of the game that we just didn't really touch. Yeah, the crafting we failed at that the first time too. I just feel like I don't know, when you're playing when you're doing a let's play and you're playing co-op, it's really hard to kind of focus on those really it is. time consuming side things. Yes. Yes, absolutely. It doesn't work very well. We could have done it off camera, I guess, but we only have like an hour or two a week to play, so Yeah. <laughs> like Rather do that hard recording. Work. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, if I ever play again I'll definitely do it, like dabble in that stuff. Yeah, because I'm sure it's worthwhile. It's just the idea with that is you put in the time, yes. and then you. But it's it's the it's it's a time that you don't have when we're doing this sort of thing. Yeah, I would love to like. Is is there a harder difficulty in this game? Because I feel like yeah. that would be really fun to well, try to. Yeah, we played it. I we played it remember. on one of. We played it on one of the hardest. One, not the easiest. I know we didn't no. play it on the easiest, but no. I don't know if there was anything above what we picked. I'm not sure. But maybe in the like uh, the updated edition there is, I don't know. Yeah, there, there probably will be. And you know, since we finished the game, it might unlock. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, you know, sometimes that happens, doesn't it? Yeah. Or you know, in the first game there was like the the achievement or and the option to go solo. Maybe that's a thing in this yeah, game too. Yeah, you can do that in this. Yeah. I think that makes can. it harder for sure. Yeah. One thing I really liked actually was um, going back to like the NPCs was how you could design them your own way. Mm -hmm. So, you yeah. know, because in so many RPGs, it's like, I really like this character, but this character's a cleric, and I'm already a cleric, so I don't need, you know, so you can't take them because of... Yeah, my, you that know, is I'm really cool. Sub I agree. Up. So when you first meet them, like, well, you know, I'm... What do you want me to be? I could be a mage, I could be a warrior. Mm -hmm. and so you, you basically yeah. just designed it around that, and then you could build skills afterwards as well. Yep. It's really nice. Now I this, like that too. This is, this is a tune. This is a, this is, this is a song. This is a good song, yeah. Um, so yeah, you could you could design your your oh, party. Look, look, Nathan, the man with many cheeses. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, not enough cheese I in this game. You, not enough not enough cheese sellers. Oh, the man of many cheeses. <laughs> not enough time for cheese. <laughs> not enough time oh. for cheese. Oh, yeah. Good. I miss yeah. that. I miss that town square. <laughs> Every time we'd start there. This this game. I don't know whether it, whether it's whether it's true, but I mean this game seemed to like move us along a little bit quicker. It did. Um, yeah. Because in the, in, well, the I think in the first game, game had, there was like maybe there's one so up. much. There's a giant chunk of the game where you're just walking in, around talking to people. Yeah, in the uh, river or whatever it was. 
yeah in that in that first main town it mm -hmm. takes so long and it is unfortunate too because it's like the very beginning of the game yeah so it's sort of hard to get past that bit um, yeah this one's much better paced yeah it is because you start in better. fort joy and there's only so many people and and you sort of like it's a small area so you start doing yeah. quests by accident whereas in that you've got like a rather large rather large town and everything's yep. outside of that so when you're in the town you know, there's only a couple of quests in there and you so yeah, there is a bit of downtime, I guess, isn't there? When you're just like running around, collecting everything, and then you go out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It also felt yeah. in this one as well that there was, there was a little more freedom about where to go. Um, yeah, because they had, in the first game, there was all those areas like locked off, and they're like, are yeah. you sure? You're too low level. Don't go here yet. Yeah, there was none of that in this one, was there? No, no. You always yeah, felt it that, was, that you could explore an old harder. area. But it still remained very challenging in certain areas. But It sure did, yeah. We never. It was really well designed. I. Yeah, it was really a nice place in terms of difficulty. Absolutely. Yep. And then sometimes you could go back to an area and, and beat things really easily, which is nice. It's nice to do. Yeah. Um, progression. Mm -hmm. One of the fights that Maybe. really stands out for me is the one in the oil pits, the black pits yeah. with all the fire that actually it actually broke my recording because there was so much fire. So yeah, it's there was all those, just... uh, all those like weird summon guys. Yeah, there was all those blobs, and then yeah, the blobs, the blobs died, the blobs. And then made fire, and then there was just like fire everywhere, and that that was really memorable for me. Just the, the field of fire. That was a cool one. Yeah, yeah, that definitely stood out for me as as one of the bit more memorable fights in the game. Yeah, I just I just enjoy the combat generally. I just had so much fun zipping around the battlefield, stabbing everybody with my daggers. Yeah. It was just really stabbing rude. everyone in the side. Yeah. Yeah, and the rupture tendon <laughs> chicken thing. Like once <laughs> I figured out that combo. Yes. Oh man. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> that was yeah, and the AI just does that. I'm just gonna. I mean, yeah, we we beat the end boss, Fane, which you know is like, here's the final fight, and he just like runs and dies. That that part about it is a little silly. Mm. I I wish they. I mean, it's good for the player, but it's kind of like immersion breaking and very silly that the AI doesn't know else to yeah. not move moving equals something. losing health, so don't move. Yeah, like maybe they could have had it. I don't know if this would be really complicated, but if if they they have ruptured tendons. Maybe only move if they're like also standing in fire or something, or if they really need to get away. That but is, a so lot strange. of times they unnecessarily just move like five feet away and then kill themselves, like uh -huh. just for no reason. Um, yeah. And that's like what Fane did. Like he's like, oh, I, I didn't realize I had ruptured tendons. I'll just climb up this <laughs> this die. <laughs> yeah. Also, and he should have been immune to that, but hey, that's fine. Yeah, and he's undead, but I get that's that would be really dumb if you couldn't use that on undead because. Yeah, so I, I get why that was a thing. I just wish the AI was a little bit smarter sometimes. I like how the Undead was in it as well as like a race. So you, you could take yeah. an Undead guy and gets healed by poison. Yeah, that you was really cool. You can't heal in a normal way. Thing. Yeah, that was you really neat. You don't get that a lot, do you? No, no. It's hard to balance, but they made it really doable in this game. Yeah, it was a very well-balanced game. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I would say absolutely. Indeed. Man, there's a lot of credits. Well, yeah. Well, it's, it's all the kick, kick backers. Kickstarter. <laughs> Kickstarter backers. backers for Kickstarter, yeah. What I'm worried about, though, and I think we'll have to call it, is if we get to the end of this, and it's like there's another tier of backers. Because oh, these, these are all the people who give like $50, and there's another <laughs> list of like people oh. who give $25. It's like, so we're going to call oh. it there, but we'll, we'll, um, we're on this. Yeah. You know, we'll go to the end of this. One. the end. So, yeah. Oh, is it gonna end? Yes, it is. Uh, there we go. Yay! There we go. We we got. We got through it. Oh no! Well, yeah, that's just those. Lovely, lovely credits, by the way. Yeah, yeah. I like the I like the paper thing. Like it looks like a big scroll, and it's like slowly moving as well. Mm -hmm. Nice. Yeah, yeah. There's lots of nice little touches in the game. All the weapons look great, if if ridiculous. The different armor yeah. sets Ooh, and everything. One other minor complaint, though, about the armor is that there, there was hardly any variation, like looks for the mm. armor. Like every hat for yeah. rogues looked the same. Every hat for mages looked the same. Or light armor and heavy armor. You know, it was very few models. Yeah, that's true. The one that was looked really good, but yeah, a bit of. Yeah, but it would have been cooler if, like, we you know we progressively looked way more awesome by the end of the game. We just well, always kind of. Same. Well, yeah, I mean, the mage armor was more cool looking than the rogue type armor. Yes. Awesome. Yeah. 
But Fane looked kind of cool at the end, I guess, too. Yeah. Yeah. But, yeah, not not very many complaints, though. Generally, it was really, really freaking awesome. Yeah, well, if we didn't enjoy it, we wouldn't have sat and played it for 90 hours. Yeah. Has it been 90 hours? About. You reckon? About 90. I don't know what yeah. episode this is, so about that. This is 92, I think? No. Or yeah. less than? Yeah. All right. Think, wait, that might that might not be right. I'm not sure. Don't don't quote me on that. Just about <laughs> 90 hours. <laughs> it's fine. Fine. I was fine. trying. To, I was looking at my my folder of recordings, uh -huh. and I have some of them un unnumbered. So, mm -hmm. you know, I might be wrong, but it's fine. Yeah, and some episodes were slightly over an hour. Some might be slightly under. Yeah. Yeah. This one. This one mm -hmm. over. Most of them were over. <laughs> Well, look, I mean, because the comeback took a little while to do, didn't it? It was fun, but obviously yeah, it had been turn-based like, and everything. Then. Yeah, you can't just, like, stop in the middle of a combat very easily. No. No, it would break the flow, wouldn't it? Yes. Yes. All right. Well, well I guess that's it. That is it. Um, once again, everybody, thank you very much for watching and putting up with us. And uh, Yeah. We enjoyed, enjoyed it very For much. this adventure. We'll be back sometime soon with another new adventure of some kind. We will. We will. Yes. And uh, thank you, Lilia, for putting up with me once again. And thank you too, Variax. I appreciate it. All right. Cheers very much, and see you, everybody. Bye-bye, friends. Toodaloo.